It is a go. The owners of Encore Boston Harbor just told the Gaming Commission they are ready to open on schedule. The highly anticipated opening was in question for the last few days amid talks of a sale. Good afternoon. Thanks for joining us. I'm Kate Merrill. And I'm Chris McKinnon. Today, the owners of Encore said they're committed to Everett and ready to roll. WBZ's Anna Myler has the story. Encore Boston Harbor just told the Mass Gaming Commission here at a meeting that they are on schedule to open their doors in Everett right on time, which had been a concern for some. MGM has backed out of talks with Wynn Resorts about potentially buying Encore Boston Harbor just weeks before its scheduled opening. Speculation of a sale raised concerns about a delayed opening and also worried officials in Springfield. That's because under state law, a company can only own one casino at a time. So if MGM had bought Encore and Everett, they would have had to sell their property in Springfield. The mayors of Springfield and Everett and Governor Charlie Baker all oppose this. So MGM announced Tuesday they have ended discussions, writing in part, we have noted the anxiety raised by various stakeholders regarding a transaction, and this troubles us at MGM. We only wish to have a positive impact on communities in which we operate. The Mass Gaming Commission chair addressed the issue at a meeting this morning. These discussions have reportedly ceased. To be clear, at no time was there a proposed transaction pending before the commission. However, like many, we were, of course, closely monitoring developments. And our focus appropriately remained and continues to remain on the regulatory preparations needed to open Encore Boston Harbor. Encore Boston Harbor says they are in good shape to open their doors on June 23rd at 10 a.m. Reporting in Boston, Anna Myler, WBZ News. The Gaming Commission also voted 4 to 1 to let Encore serve alcohol to customers who are actively gambling on the floor until 4 a.m.